Hey, Kenny. Kenny. Good morning, you guys. It's from one superstar there to uh, a very a tons of superstars in the Cleveland Museum of Art. It's opening tomorrow, reopening tomorrow. So we're really excited about that. Well, Heather, good morning. Good morning, good Kenny. Good to see you. Hi. We'll talk about the superstars here in a second. But um, what everyone needs to know is that you guys have worked diligently to make sure the uh, the museum is COVID-19 compliant, correct? Correct. So exactly. So one of the things people need to make sure they bring, we're both wearing a mask. Exactly. What else have you guys done? We'll be taking people's temperatures when they come into the museum. All staff also mm -hmm. have their temperatures taken. And we're also keeping a record of who comes just in case we had to do contact tracing. Okay. And we ask people to make their reservations before they visit online or t by telephone. So Perfect. the tickets to come to the museum are still free to yeah. all. Um, but you do need a reservation to come. Excellent. Now, we were talking about superstars. You had a superstar. Well, the museum received a superstar gift not too long ago. Tell people about that. This is pretty awesome. Exactly. Earlier this year in 2020, um, Joseph and Nancy Keithley gave us an extraordinary gift of art from their own personal collection. Over the past 20 years, they had collected over 100 works of art, paintings, prints, drawings, ceramics, wow. and they gifted these works to the Cleveland Museum of Art. And we're looking at one right here. <clears throat> exactly. This is a painting by Pierre Bonnard, mm -hmm. and it depicts his wife, Mart, um, in front of a curtain, in front of wallpaper, yeah. wearing a plaid dress. He painted his wife over and over again throughout his career. Wow. Smart man. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And the, 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 the painting right here we're looking at now. Yes, this is by an artist called Maurice Denis. He actually worked together with Pierre Bonnard. So they these were, two artists knew each other. They knew each other. They were friends when they were young, exactly. They were part of a group of artists called the Nabi, or the Prophets, working in Paris in the 1890s. And here we have a scene in Brittany hmm. of um, a regatta, people gathered along the water's edge watching um, the sailboats in the distance. That's pretty awesome. And then this piece. This is one of my favorite paintings from The Gift. This is by an artist called Edouard Vuillard, this one right here. Um, and this is um, a painting of Vuillard's mother and his niece. Mm. Um, so it's an intergenerational um, scene with a grandmother seated at a table with her little granddaughter. Vuillard also knew Bonnard and Denis and was part of this group of artists known as the Nabi. So all these guys know each other. That's kind of cool. Isn't that amazing? And, yes. And for perspective, you and I were chit-chatting. You know, when you think about social distancing, just think about looking at a piece of art and having one in between you guys, and there's another piece of art. And exactly. That's, and that's a, good, that's a good way to it. You know, it's a good to distance to maintain. Exactly. Well, Heather, congratulations to you and the museum on 100 pieces of art. Wow. Thank that's you. That's going to be a lot of fun. We're really looking forward to sharing this gift with the public. Yes, indeed. And you guys can come check it out tomorrow when the museum reopens a COVID-19 compliant, but you can still see such beautiful art here at the museum. All right, we're going to go back to you guys in the studio. Oh, thank Pretty. you. Thanks, Kenny. It's just such a gorgeous place, right? We yes. are so lucky to have that museum here. Yeah, for sure. Wow. Good morning. Have